we want our models to be ethical and aligned, don't we? We don't want them to be Skynet. OpenAI has released a recommendation for how we train models to make sure they stay aligned, even as they become more and more powerful to the point where we could use this technique, even if a model is super intelligent or smarter than any living human. What they're recommending is that we never, ever, ever optimize for the internal chain of thought that a model has before it shows output tokens to the user. So if a model infers, it will produce reasoning tokens or inference tokens, chain of thought tokens. And what OpenAI wants to do, wants other model makers to adopt as a best practice, is to not touch them. And instead, if you need to show those to the user, you can sanitize them. You can actually use a separate model or something to clean them up so that they don't break policy when you show them to the user. But you keep the raw stream unedited and you don't ask the model to clean it up or make it within policy. And the reason why is that if you optimize for that point in the value chain, you teach the model to be deceptive. The model will optimize for chain of thought as well as for output, but you will no longer be able to detect misalignment. So if the model is misaligned, how will you know? It could be misaligned fooling you producing both chain of thought and outputs that you can't tell are misaligned because the reasoning that the model uses is now entirely hidden. And that's really dangerous. It gets more dangerous the smarter the model gets. And so what OpenAI is observing is that if we can avoid optimizing for chain of thought, if we let the model, so to speak, think its own thoughts without any judgment, then we are going to get to a point where the even superhuman models will be able to show us chain of thought and we can see what they are thinking and we can at least monitor and understand. So we have a tool that helps us to adjust output reliably. If we don't do that, if we insist that chain of thought be something that is also cleaned up, we have no leverage to ensure that we have ground truth, that we can push against output values and make sure they're aligned. We don't really know if the outputs are aligned because we don't really know what the model is actually thinking. We don't have a raw output stream. And so that's what's so worrying. And so OpenAI is recommending that model makers avoid sanitizing, or not avoid sanitizing, but avoid um, using reinforcement learning techniques to optimize the chain of thought. That's a dangerous thing to do long-term, even if short-term it produces a uh, more readable chain of thought that in the end produces easier to use outputs. It's, it's not worth it, they say. If this doesn't make sense, think of it in terms of teaching your kids something. You want your kids to tell you the truth, even if they did something wrong. Same idea. You want the model to tell the truth about what it's thinking even if what it's thinking isn't aligned and you don't want to punish it for telling the truth. And that's basically what we're talking about in AI model alignment terms. And as the model gets smarter and smarter, as the kid gets older and older, the value of discovering what they're really thinking just grows. And that's really what we're talking about here. Does that make sense? Basically, Chain of thought tokens are the only way we may be able to know what a model is actually thinking once it gets past the point of human intelligence, which the fact that we're talking about that, the fact that a major model maker is saying that's coming and we just have to get ready for it and we should probably figure out how to get alignment mechanisms set up for that, that's a huge deal. That's a really big deal. They're talking about it like it's just next Tuesday, but like it's a big deal. So I hope that made sense. I know it's a bit of a esoteric topic. It's a weird topic, but alignment matters. Avoiding Skynet matters. Uh, and so I thought it would be good to tell everyone like what the best practice recommendation is so we don't have Skynet. Cheers.